so I just gotta record my thoughts real quick. So I just got out of watching Swan Lake, right? And so basically, it's a ballet, right? And people are dancing, etc., etc. Right? Okay. So the story about of Swan Lake is really just the story of BYU and all of its stereotypical glory. Okay, so BYU, you know, like the school, people getting married and stuff. Okay, so this story is about Mr. BYU. That's the protagonist of Swan Lake, okay? And so he just gets home from his mission and he goes hunting with his friends because that's what Republicans do, you know what I'm saying? And so... Mr. BYU, he's fresh off his mission. He ain't looked at a woman in that way, you know what I'm saying? In like, I don't know how long has it been? Two years? Yeah. Okay, and so he's out hunting with his friends, and they see a bunch of birds, and they finna shoot the birds, right? Because that's what they do. They're hunting, and they're just trying to kill things. Okay, so... I'm backing up. Hold up. Okay, so this man's fresh off his mission, been, you know, preaching the word and stuff. And um, they see a bunch of birds. And he sees this one bird and he said, Doggone, that bird is hot. Uh, look at that, she blonde. And they're like, Bro, it's just a bird, man. Like, we finna shoot it. But he says, No, nah, man, I'm gonna pr- don't shoot these birds because this one's super hot, right? <laughs> That's just how. Return missionaries be thinking sometimes. Okay, so they're like, whatever, dog. We're just gonna, we're just gonna leave. And he decides to stay and dance with this bird. And they do their whole little dancing. And honestly, the dancing was really impressive. Um, like the athleticism, ten out of ten. Um, but story wise, okay. So the bird leaves because she's a bird, right? Also, there's this spooky black bird um with like this vulture mask and um nobody ever actually figures out what he's doing but he's like all spooky and stuff and very ominous okay and the curtain goes down and your boy mr byu he's like oh no my blonde-headed girlfriend she left me it's just a bird okay all right next scene totally different and they're in some kind of castle and they're doing a dance party and so this is a little dance party turns out mr byu is the prince because his mom and daddy are rich he's blonde too and now it's time for him because he's a return missionary to pick himself a little wife and so they're having this nice little dance party a bunch of people wearing costumes and they're having a good time um, it took very long. I don't know why they took so long with the dance party. I feel like I would be exhausted and go home by the end of that dance party before the end, whatever. But, um, I'm, I'm not like railing on the dancers or nothing because they killed it for real. Like very impressive. But Mr. BYU, he's doing his thing and his mama comes in, he said, and, um, She's like the queen. She's sitting on a throne and being all elegant and stuff. And they bring in, there's like, oh, I don't know, like five or six, maybe seven um, little princesses with their dresses on. And so it's time for him to pick one. And that's who he's going to marry. And they give him a little bouquet. And he's got to pick one. And he says, nah, like, I, I'm not going to do it. And decides to not pick any of them. And his mom's all, all sad. Because her little boy is going to be one of those degenerates that don't get married. Okay. And then. His goth girlfriend from before the mission. You know like Taylor Swift. Like she wears high heels. I wear sneakers. Like goth girlfriend from back when he realized he was actually really hot. She comes in with her older brother. And they're both wearing their black clothes. You know and everything being all goth and stuff and he remembers her and decides oh i'm gonna dance with this chick and so they dance and then they have this nice little spinning competition a dancing competition and all his homeboys are dancing and spinning too 
And then the older brother says, hey, yo, like, so, um, break it up with my little sister, you know what I'm saying? And so he's all traumatized and everything. All of a sudden, the ghost of this bird shows up. I don't know why, but whatever. The ghost of the bird shows up and then he realizes he's actually in love with this bird. Um, so screw the goth girlfriend. I'm going to go hit up this hottie because uh, she's blonde and my goth girlfriend is goth. I don't That's how he's thinking, right, Mr. BYU? All right. She didn't have a chance anyways because <laughs> whatever. I don't know. And so surprise, um, curtain goes down again and now we're back to the scene where there's all these swans. And Mr. BYU stumbles in, and he's all traumatized. Oh, my goodness, what I've done. Like, I'm acting like I'm going to marry this goth girlfriend. But I had just forgotten this one bird I met one time, and I decided I wanted to marry her. But then, whatever, okay. And so he's acting like he's asking for forgiveness from this bird. The bird, of course, is a bird. And she's just doing her little dancing thing. Surprise, Mr. Vulture Man. Um, he's showing up and he just does something. I guess it's magic. And um, he's doing his little magic thing. Throws Mr. BYU on the ground. Oh my goodness, his life is so hard. He's had some trials when he came home from his mission. And the swan is a swan. Oh, But all of a sudden she flies away and he's so sad. Because she's gone. His perfect little blondie. Okay. Then he gets chased up onto the same rock where the swan got out. And then the bird man that's all dark and spooky. He does his whole little like, oh no, I'm dying kind of dance. And um, I don't even know where he went, but I guess he left. And all the dancers are doing their little thing because they're swans. It looks really cool. And all of a sudden, there's this woman in a different costume comes out. I guess it's the same swan. And um, they hug or something, and that's the end, right? Um, <laughs> kind of wild. Very BYU because he's just trying to get his... <laughs> His poor little wife, you know, he's a return missionary. And, um, of course, all the women are just fawning over him because he's got a nice little crew cut. And all the other male dancers, their fade kind of sucks. And uh, his parents are rich. So he's got all these women all around him. And long story short, Mr. BYU ends up with the blonde chick. That was a bird. <laughs> so, as far as impressions, ballet looks freaking hard because Swan, like the girl that plays the Swan Lake, uh, I mean, her name's not Swan Lake, but it's like Odette or something. I looked in the program. And so, like the dancing she was doing, from the very little I know about dancing, I don't know how she kept dancing because that must have been exhausting. So, kudos to her and everybody else um especially because they had all these other dancers just stand there watching them do their little thing um yeah so that was kind of weird but it was cool and yep tchaikovsky wrote the music i love that guy and uh so yep that's all i'm thinking and, um, yeah, I got some pizza, something like that. Uh, yep. Yeah.